All right, let's go. Raps con, here we come. <laughs> Boom. This <laughs> looks like it's a no. <laughs> yes, we found it. Hi, friend. How are you? Oh, I'm so good. Can you get the car behind me too? I don't know, but he's super nice. He let me in, and when we were on the, over there, I was like this, and he let me in. She could literally care less about a single thing you said. Oh, look at that upfront parking. She told him. He goes, who said that? He goes, the one that's driving. <laughs> Let's do this. So we're taking a quick break from the shop. We're here at Rascon in Long Beach, California. So it took about an hour, hour and a half to get here. Uh, we only have about two hours to walk the show before it closes. So we better get everything done real fast. Hope to meet some of the vendors, meet some of the distributors that we work with. And I don't know, whatever else comes along the way, we'll show you guys. If we go the wrong way? Oh, just follow the, the bridge thing. I was like, damn, Johnny really knows his way around here. <laughs> we was going the wrong way. <laughs> We're going that way. This is a cool bridge though. What the Awesome seeing you. Yeah, there is. I got one for Bill, right up front, right there. <laughs> that was yes. Sick. There's some real good ideas for Is there? Oh, yeah. Hi. So nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you, Johnny. Nice. <laughs> What's all separate here? Is this it separate layer? Okay. We're gonna do it on this side. All the way die cut, all the way through there, up to there, right that cut mark right there. Okay. They have that for sure, you know, strike. Something there. To find it. Yeah. yeah. This is we're kind of just okay, what do you we're, want to know? so we're just looking at the printed panel here. Obviously this is no reflection, right? And this is actually the like you said, the first lines in our in the original, right? Lost metal aluminum printed. Ten eighty printed with a matte laminate. Got it. Okay. This is the bottom layer. And then this is the this is actually the Arlon aluminum. Oh wow. So then even up here, this is the original wrap that's connected to this right? Yes. So, so gradient, this up. and this is one piece. Got it. Yeah. Gotcha. The seam is right under here. Got it. Okay. So that way you can't you can't reach the hole. Right, right. So you put your seam. Oh wow. So is that is that what you would have been doing? To get these properly sized? Like a template? Yeah. Or is that an outline on it? Oh that's printed into it. All right, so that is the first printed wrap we've seen so far. We're gonna check out a couple other things. This one looks crazy. Why'd 
you stop? <laughs> you're buying tools. <laughs> you're buying tools? <laughs> you have tools for sale? Oh, yes. Yeah. Sweet. Discounted rate for wraps time. Anything you guys want, get it. If I need for it, let's get it. And just take one swipe. Very cool. <laughs> and then if you really want to just On the outside try line, I only need one line. And that's the middle. So pick your line. Yeah, so I'm gonna pick my line. I just need the middle, so I'm just gonna cut the outside line. I'm gonna pull the river, snap it, and cut that. I want one of you guys to try this now. See, yeah, get all got it. That's cool. Bro. Right, because you. I didn't catch that. How did you do that? So what I did was I took it and I cut the, the outside lines off. Okay, and then you're gonna take this off, like that, and then squeegee. Okay, so this one's a fun one. Now you got to get all three. This section right to here. Yep. Perfect. There you go. What is this boat gonna get right here a lot? Sweet man. Right, so, like, it's that easy for that. Here's your racing stripes. That's awesome. You know, you have those hoods that are too big. Yeah. Right. And now you gotta split them in half. Right. Well, like older BMWs. Older BMW also, yeah. Because what I'm gonna suggest, you know, you have to do an overlap, right? So what I want you guys to do is a butt joint, butt seam on the roof, and then your fender, right? Right. Here's your roof, and just wrap over top of your tri line. Yeah, so I'm gonna cut on each side. Okay, got it. Okay. And just getting rid of the other two. Yeah, like this. I think you're really gonna like the look of this after the side. Okay, and then we're gonna move this, remove this. Okay, leaving one okay, second. Okay. Oh, so it's already there. You don't have to. Yeah, you have to right. That's gotcha. why the tri line. So you always get gotcha. the middle. So you're gonna overlap, right? Right. We're gonna remove this side. Okay. Then we remove the, the carrier. So that's removing from under this one. Yeah. It's lifting this one. You're gonna have to lay that one and that one. Yeah, and see the one that's left underneath because you cut through two layers. Got it. Right? <laughs> okay, so when that's done, usually I squeegee the opposite way. Got it. Right? Okay, so now you're gonna feel that a little bit, but it's kind of it's clean though. It's very okay, clean. But it gets better. Nice and hot. Oh nice. See how it's disappearing? Yeah, that's like invisible. Give me a roll. Are you selling it? Yeah, so that's not, I'm not finished yet because yes, I'm not finished yet. Okay, usually what happens is this, right? So you take this and you make an overlap, okay? I don't even see the seam anymore. It's gone. Since you just did, that's an overlap. So you see the two lines right. there? Okay. I always recommend covering the butt joint because it'll separate and depending right. on the color it's going to look bad. What we want to do is actually rewrap the roof yeah. to show your customer you can do the overlap or you re So the whole roof gets rewrapped. So now the thing is, is that you've actually covered your butt joint. The paint's not going to show through. Right. Right? And you got that look. Right? So it's virtually invisible. Right. But then you see that. that. So if you show the customer that you can have this look on a Rolls Royce, or you can have this look, which really, you have to make sure it's nice and tight. Right. Right? Because that could leave gaps. And right. I'm from Winnipeg, so the cold air would actually turn, you know, yeah. make that chatter, right? So you get so, the protection here, yeah, you got peace of mind, you know yeah. it's not going to come And up. it looks so clean. That, that looks amazing. So, man. we got some tape for you. Thank you, man. So, Cool. Dude, thank you so much for giving that demo. So awesome. Good man. Cool. <laughs> what do you think of that demo? I don't know, like, we have nice tape to shop all the time. We got roses all day. But to see it from these guys who know all about it, it was awesome. Because I feel like I, I didn't even know about the product. So if you think you know, you may not know. <laughs> that, that demo was tight, right? <laughs> <laughs>
Uh, now that is a wide format. Holy crap. Crazy day so far. We're eating our first meal of the day, breakfast. It's only four o'clock, so we're about to have some breakfast real quick. <laughs> and we're gonna continue walking through the show. Uh, so far, so good. We met a lot of people already. We've only been here for like 20 minutes, and a lot of people came up, either fans or people we work with. So that 3M demo was crazy, though. Yeah. When, you, when you put the heat on, that disappeared. Mm -hmm. I've never seen a scene like that. Because what it is, it's a literally a butt scene. They're butted up 100%. Is there, is there any negatives to that though? Negative is if you run it just like that, the sun will split it. That's why he said you have to do the second layer. So that's why he was saying like for an extra cost if they really wanted. Absolutely. That's only really for if it's a roof that's too big. Mm -hmm. Otherwise you don't need that, right? Right. Really, really clean look though. That was a good hot dog. What are we checking out next? We're going to go over and see the Rap Institute. Crazy. Go find Daniel in the last for a second. Ooh, this thing's sick. Oh, I found him. Matt is E. Dude, this hot dog was good. Let's go try to find Daniel. I see him. All right, so we're kind of in two groups right now. We keep getting split up a little bit between me, Johnny, uh, Bill's here with us, if you guys didn't see that already, and uh, Daniel is with Johnny's dad, which is so dope, because they're having a ball looking at a whole bunch of different stuff. And we're kind of doing different stuff as well, so we're all just like back and forth, but we keep losing each other. Every time we come back together, we keep losing each other, but I think we just found them again, so. I see you guys. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you for showing me around. German, which this is a German film, I think that's how this is. Okay, but it's off center. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I still have a critique. Black uh, Subi, I think. Uh, I saw that in the car wash not too long ago. That's funny, man. Yeah. Where you live? Uh, I stay in Anaheim. In Anaheim? Yeah. Okay, was it the one with the. Probably. Had red uh, vinyl decals on the back, dark yeah. tent? Yep. Yeah. Yeah, it's Steezy's car. Oh, oh yeah. That's awesome. Yeah, gotcha. Gotcha. Well, Thank you, brother. Right, right on. Yeah. Ooh, Lambo. This thing is sick. What? I like that. That means leave, guys. All right, so it looks like we're basically all finished up. Everyone's kind of funneling out. Awesome. I see my logo on the floor, and I was like, wow. Yeah, all right. And then Justin, Justin says, yeah, super. I didn't even know that was gonna happen. That was cool. It was awesome. And I seen you rocking the shirt to come up. I appreciate that. I can even actually get a ton of yeah. so thank you for it, man. Appreciate that. Good to meet you in person. Very, very too, cool. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> wrapped up podcast uh, so I did an interview with him probably six months ago six months ago and his podcast has evolved way further since then so uh, if you guys want to hear it I'll link it below but more than anything make sure you go check out the podcast if you're into rap if you're into vehicle vehicle rapping or just the business side in general there's a lot to learn over there so I'm excited that I got to be on when I was yeah, you know, super that. early on so thank you for that So I don't know if this is the end of the vlog, or the beginning of the vlog, or the middle of the vlog. But so far, it's been a good time here at RapsCon. Um, we met a lot, a lot of people. Did not expect that. So super cool, super humbling. I think being recognized in your industry is not something that you strive for. I don't know how to even put that out there and how to put it in words. But when you get recognized for your craft, not necessarily for your Instagram or your logo, but for your craft or what you do, that's amazing. That's a feeling that you really can't compare to. So we did meet a lot of people that are very familiar with raps and they know what quality is and they know what the, the work that we're putting out and then they're commending us for that. That's amazing. So super humbling. Thankful to be here. I look forward to the next one. And uh, I guess that's the end of this vlog. See you guys in the next one.